Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Fablehaim and the long Kongrong Khan, now spearheaded by the silver eminence, Simayi. We mourn for the loss of our king, but we continue onward, destroying our rivals Justice to unite China in wisdom. We will bring righteousness so, to this settlement. on that note, we continue to push against Shui Hui, I have an idea. I don't know if it's a good idea, but it is an idea, and I have it. Over here, as you can see, we are um, in for some pain, you could say. <laughs> this guy, Jian Yong, is coming towards us, and Sai Mao is being somewhat aggressive. So Sima Fu is going to go in this direction, because Gong Ji, finally freed of the blasted Yi Zhou Islands, is coming up from the south. Hopefully nothing comes from this direction, but he'll just kind of swoop around and eat everything up. We want to claim the capital, the seat of power from Sun Tzu at the very end. We'll just take all of his territory, and then we'll take the capital. Because that will, of course, give us the imperial mandate. I return. How, How fair the people. Which, um... We'll put us on relatively bad terms with Liu Bei, who happens to be right next to us in a number of ways. Additionally, I was thinking we might want to move our capital. Our capital is currently Dong Lai, our imperial city, up here in the north. But, um, I don't know if you've noticed, Liu Bei is right here, and so is the kingdom of Yan. It is quite vulnerable from our soon-to-be nemeses. And I don't like that. I really don't. So I was thinking of moving it down south, maybe just in the corner over here. <laughs> Who knows? As for Yuan Shu, where are we going with Yuan Shu? We could head south. We could head south. I think we will. This will allow uh, Zhang Yan to just go crazy over here. So we'll head south to cut through this territory. Probably reclaim Sangwu. Hopefully Sai Mao does not take Changsha, because I can't really do anything about that. At the moment, do we want to pick up a new unit? We have just archers. I don't like that. Not a fan of archers. Onyx dragons. We can only get one. Is there anything else we want to place in the meantime? Um, yes. Hold on. Undo that real quick. Why do you have archers? That is the real question here. What do we replace it with? More calf? <laughs> Pearl Dragons. Why would I even ask? What a silly question. If you're ever in doubt, Pearl Dragon it out. That probably doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but it's what I said. We still have our deals moving on with uh, some of our friends, so we are going to end the turn and hope everything goes swell. Sao Sao is down to some of his final settlements at long last. Ooh, we might lose this Toolmaker. And by might lose it, I mean we're pretty much going to lose it. This army is deteriorated, but this one is full strength. So, um, rip. Oh, and if we claim ourselves as emperor, we'll get new units. We can get some explosive arrows of our own. I'm looking forward to that. And the heavy glaive infantry, because they're pretty cool. Now, I don't I'm not a fan of this aggression from Machao and his various vassals. They, of course, took Nanyang from us, and we abandoned the Jade Mine. Zhang Feng Ping, who are you? I mean, Liu Bei is okay with this. You don't like me, though. War atrocities against our friend. Yeah, I did do that. Oh, you're Zhang Yan. Oh... Sure. Why not? Our coalition grows. You know, for a little bit until we declare ourselves emperor and then it's going to disappear. Wouldn't it be really depressing if Shihui took over <laughs> Liu Bei's seat of power? I mean, then we could remain friends with Liu Bei, so that's a thing. Kingdom of Yan formed a coalition with Jia Long. The Duchy of Song. Oh, a succession. Yuan Ao has passed away. He has been succeeded by Yuan Jie. 
kind of looks the same. We have lost the toolmaker. Yes, but Chao signed peace with the kingdom of Shu Han. Faction confederated. Oh, Shu Han absorbed Liu Wan. Huh. I don't like that, Liu Bei. I really don't. I really don't. Zhang Fang Ping signed peace with the kingdom of Shu Han and created a coalition with us. As we all are aware, who are these people? No one. I think Sao is trying to send a spy. Kong Yuan is now elusive. My son. Sang Wu is about to have a rebellion, probably because Sang Wu already has a rebellion. I must refuse. That's odd. Wait, you're healing and sieging me? That's not fair. Hey, look. I found that army that disappeared. Hmm. This is Impossible. problematic now. I'd love to turn around and kill them, but you know what they're going to do, right? They're just going to flee like the cowards they are. So, what if we go here and ambush? We have a 100% chance, probably because of you, huh? You're pretty good. The ageless strength, 93 years old. What a bro. I don't actually think it is you. Ooh come from spice we don't have all the spice yet we just have most of it <laughs> um, I'm not sure who's giving us ambush and I don't really care anymore but we have it that's all that matters drawing a bow. hold the breath no advancing just get in the port oh, I can reach this guy oh we are in force march gather everyone there are plans and we can't go to normal but that's okay we're forced march, but we don't really need to replenish. Nothing terrible is happening. Bring news of what Everything is absence. fine. Great, the spice market. And uh, our progress with Yuan Shu has been delayed a little bit, but I think we just go. I think we just keep going. We'll take his capital, make him laugh, make him laugh. Attend. We will laugh at him. Gongji, we see an army of. Sun Tzu's here. What do we think of it, though? We think we take this copper mine. I might have to fight this to limit... This is what eh, you maybe not. Nah, it seems fine. It was pretty wounded already. So we'll just grab this, take it for ourselves. Oh yeah, look, we barely took any damage. Well, Taishi said it a little bit. This belongs to us now. We have a treasure. Ha uh ha. -huh. A runner arrives from the new settlement with a heavy box strapped to his crooked back. Panting heavily, the breathless man slams his bulky consignment down at your feet before collapsing. It is a loot chest with its lock broken open, filled to the brim with jewels and precious trinkets of considerable value. Caution. Douse is the 500 gold is considerable value? I disagree. Lift the Balian. This is going to be a real fight. I think we wait one more turn because we are mustering our cavalry. I don't know if I just light cav. Yeah. For the people. Don't let Sao Sao recover. Evenly matched a close defeat. Who are you? Jiang Jun. Zushu. I think that's one of... Oh, Jishu. Sorry, not Zushu. We shall starve out. Crush them! If they come at us, they shall die. I think that's the only army Sao Sao has remaining. So good. I'm a fan of Sao Sao dying, you know? Uh, increasing commerce. Seems good. Because of the trade port. And I think that's all we can really do. Our income was lowered for some reason. Hmm. I don't think any of our deals expired. We can check, of course. Real quick. The Kingdom of Shu Han. Our deal is still in effect. Your deal is still in effect. And so is yours. We might have lost trade with somebody, so let's take a check. We can still only trade with Tao Ying. Any vassals? I don't want to become a vassal. I'm not submitting to the cause. All right. Well, that went well. <laughs> I believe that is all we can do for this turn. I don't really want to spend any more money, so we shall move on to the next one.
I think Changsha and Sang Wu are both almost up. They're almost out of. Uh... Oh. So he wants to join, but these guys don't want him to join. So we just kind of acknowledge that they don't like him. You know? Our coalition is a democracy. And here they come. The fools. Our generals aren't at full health, so maybe I should have waited one more turn. Bold and strong, victory will be ours. Eh. The alliance is going to go duel them all anyway. We must focus on battle, not on your redundant thought. Wow. Don't fight your own teammates, bro. Stand tall and vibrant, even as the world sheds its life. Silence. Are words your only weapon? Draw your blades. Oh, you're about to see my blade. You're not going to like it. They are attacking me, so we kind of just let them come. Frostmourne hungers. You have an amazing ranged uh, retinue, so... Kind of just let that do its job, methinks. Put them near the water, just in case. I forgot you had so many Azure Dragons. Good, 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 good. Maybe we should put... Ah, screw it. We shall have the GN sword guards to either side. It shall remain one group. And the pearl dragons, I think we'll try and either inundate the line with them or flank with them. It seems like an intelligent approach. What abilities do you have again? Balian. An amazing spear. It's good enough for me. Well, it's not a spear. It's a G of the Imperial Guard. Uh, we're probably going to have to... Wait for them, huh? More enemy reinforcements are yeah. arriving. Let's go see if we can duel. March quickly. Doesn't want to duel, doesn't want to duel out of range. Make haste. So he will duel me. He's just, you know, out of range. Double we could move up a little bit. I don't see a reason why not. Like here or so. And we are going to fast forward. I might even just edit it out because usually these guys take forever. The army arrives. I probably should have changed that a while ago. And we prepare to fight. Let's go see if we can duel yet. A few people don't want to, but we'll see if Jiang Jun will duel me. Or if he'll be a coward. Just like the rest of them. Let's go. <laughs> That's going to be one down. It's very good, very good. Oh, crap. You guys need to be in a group and in mixed missile stance. Good. They haven't found my cav yet, which is good because the cavern is going to instantly die anyway. Why don't you shoot? Oh, they're not there yet. Of course, of course. Now, Balian was a little wounded before we started, but that's okay. He should be fine. Look, the enemy run! Craven. We have broken someone already. Good. Onyx, good, 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 good. I think we're just going to shoot these guys to death. That's what we're going to do. We'll need our, our crossbowmen here to shoot actual units. You are too pathetic to survive. Like perhaps this G infantry captain. Shut up and die. But with the rest of them, I think we just kill. Oh, you guys need to be on fire wheels, well. Just fire whenever you feel like it, you know? Ready. Balian is having a hard time here. Go! For Go. Come on. But I think Surely overall he is better. winning. Is that your best? Come on, try harder! I need to ignore. Crossbows at the ready. Attend oh, maybe I just let them fire on whatever they feel like, you know? Prepare. Here come my cav. My very weak cav, but they are still cav. The enemy unit flees. What cowards? They flee. I think Balian's going to win this. It's just a little scary, you know? It's scary, but it's fine. What do you do again? Oh, we should be having this up. We should have had this up a long time ago. Where are you? Here you go. Boom. 
You have Wisdom of the River. You we'll watch you use here. Need some help? Let's get the, our pearl I dragons up here. Your blade is sharper than your wit. The enemy unit flees. Balian is victorious. Soon shall. I don't actually know if he would win that, so we're going to say no. My cab got kind of stuck, but it's okay. Let's go. Uh, one of you are up here, and that's not okay. Let's get our pearl dragons in this mess. Who are you? Hey, what? Go in there. Go. You get out. You get in. Oh, you're in the back line. Can you come up here? Balian is a bit wounded, so I don't think I want to duel. What was that pop-up? Oh, get out of the spears. Wait, why are you in spears? You shouldn't be in spears. As long as Sun Shao is fighting, he is becoming stronger. So, kind of okay with just letting him do what he feels like. Pearl Dragons are all in in their various locations. What part of get out of the spears did you not understand? You are not on your horse. Good. Just come to the front line, please. Oh, catapult's done. That's okay. Uh, can you shoot into this? Because this is uh, not going swell. Could you please kill him? We'll send uh, Peijun over here as well. He can give him a good smack. He has the fighting sword, right? Yeah. Not that stupid noble sword. Hey, come back. Go this way. Please. Balian is kind of stuck. Not really a fan of that. Alright, you guys can leave your formation here and move in. You didn't use all of your ammo, but that's okay. Could you kill them, please? The crossbowmen have more armor piercing than the archers, so we definitely want the crossbow... Oh, you got ammo. We want them on the sword guard here, but I think we're just going to shoot in with everything. Oh, you can leave this. Thanks. I need to remember to exit that stance the moment they're out of ammunition. Well, and if they are... Oh, you guys are chasing him down. <laughs> and if they're not fighting anything. You know? They aren't actually glaive units, so they're heavy glaive. So they do a sizable amount of damage to pretty much everything. Kill Spear Warriors? Looks like there's a mass break that's about to happen. And because Valian isn't on his horse, he can't do any chasing, which is a little upsetting. But it is what it is. Victory! Please kill the Sentinel. I think I'm just going to let... There it goes. We don't really have anything to chase. So I don't think we will. We can try and get these guys over here, but I don't know if it's going to do anything. A little sloppy on my half, my behalf, my part. But uh, overall, I think it went pretty well. Just a few minor mistakes that can be easily remedied. And I think I was a little too impatient. You know? I think we should have waited one more turn so that our generals could be at full health. And that we had our the entire uh, unit of cav. There's our Pyrrhic victory, but we're going to replenish and continue our siege. They didn't have any supplies, so this will be an easy, decisive victory delegation after this. I'm less confident the about Chang Shan Sang We did lose one of our GN Sword Guard. We captured Jiang Jun, but um, he's not coming to our side, so let's take his dignified rank. 11% replenishment. Yes, please. Thank you very much. What is this? A decisive victory because Yuan Shu lies in wait. I think I'm just going to auto-resolve this. I'm a bit worried because the Pearl Dragons, but, you know. He was not prepared for the Yuan Shu. We can double-tap him next turn. Do we take their punishment? I think that would just affect the garrison. Oh, his army is healthy. Wait, what about the heroes? Our uh, generals took a little bit of damage, but... I think the replenishment would go to the garrison, which is pretty much worthless, so... We shall leave it be. Sun Tzu continues to move against us. Surprise, surprise. How many of his people have we beheaded? 
A sizable amount. Oh, and Chen. Yes, flee from Sima Fu. I don't think we're going to go straight after Nanyang, but I do want to kill Saimao. <laughs> Just get rid of that thorn in my side right now. Machao has made his way to our territory in the Central Plains. How troublesome. There's your Gei Liang, still incredibly low. Liu Bei, you have to treat him better. He's the sleeping dragon. Don't let him wither away. It'd be a waste. Surrender imminent in Shangsha. Yeah. Lucky shot buildings. Misery, it would seem, is often piled upon misery. The enemy find luck. One of their shots strikes true, landing upon one of our buildings. The blow frustratingly destroys a crucial beam and the entire structure collapses. The men are shaken by what they have seen and worry for our defenses. In Changsha. Ooh, Cao Cao himself is here. Well, Cao Cao. Goodbye. <laughs> I was going to fight it if it was an open field just so we could Justice kill Cao Cao ourselves, but it wasn't an open field. <laughs> We've gained something. Occupy. Only by growth will the word be spread. Units convalescing for one turn. We'll probably want to replenish for two turns. See if our. Generals can get back to full fighting strength. What did we want with you? Income industry administrated. Oh yeah, I don't remember what you were doing, Balian. I really don't. I guess mobility is not bad. Morale when attacking and battle running speed for own retinue. He doesn't have a very slow retinue. So I wouldn't mind this. I don't know if he's an administrator. We wanted Binding Fury, didn't we? So let's get Resolve and then get Binding Fury, and then we can pick up Mobility when he's level 10, if he reaches level 10. So far, the only person to reach level 10 in our faction was Kong Rong. Poor guy. Faction support, don't care. Guess we'll go this way. I don't know what he's doing at the moment, Ji Qian, but he's not at any army. Thang Yun, one of our commanders, grab zeal because why not? What is this? Range block chance for melee cav own retinue. That's not bad. We have a lot of notifications regarding our cities, but let's uh, deal with fights first. You're fine. This is going to be chaotic in just a moment. Ah, oh, yeah, we don't have the reform for this. We should probably pick that up because this is going to be tough. Tough, tough, tough. Sumafu. Do I go this way? No, we'll just kind of circle around, I think. We can reach Jia Jianyong, but I, he's just going to run away, right? You can find out. Only one way to find out. Yep. Mountain. Flee, you coward. Uh, stand back in my territory. Look at this final bit of replenishment for Gung Ji's retinue. Yuan Shu, go in two tap. Or double tap. Which I guess a double is too. But kill him. Do it now. Off with his head. Those who do not bend to authority will break upon it. True, we have captured Mat the A. He has nothing of value to steal. That's fine. Justice demands. And Nayun, who also has nothing of value to steal. They must be made an example of. But that's still okay. <laughs> well, at this point. Wow, this is terrifying. We destroyed the garrison building here, didn't we? We sure did. Why did we do that again? Probably for more money because I am greedy. Let's remedy that, shall we? Now that's a bit of our money spent, but level two is probably good enough. And sort of. Go south, go here. It would make sense to finish this off, right? To reclaim our city in Changsha and let Simafu take it from here. Oh, that's so much movement. We could force march. We don't have too much replenishment to do. Oh, yes, we do. Shouldn't have done that, but that's okay. You can't move, of course. We just did this. And Gongji. Once again, I feel the warmth of home. You're gonna take this, huh? 
You're really gonna take this. Folly. This is the Emperor. Liu Jie, the former Emperor. Huh. Sim Se got him, huh? That's unfortunate. Let the horse peel with laughter. Unfortunate indeed. I guess we let him take that. And then kill him. Let's go here. 100% chance of ambush. Ambush. Let him take that and then punch him in the face. And reclaim it. Now with Zhang Yan. What's happening? You still haven't moved. Okay. Let us take Shihui's capital. We might even make it our own. Who knows? Who knows? Not I. Our faith was rewarded. Well, I guess it's a little concerning. I should know. <laughs> In time, they will thank us for this. They will probably. I don't like this building. Go away. I like that building. Do indeed. Food. I guess we do have a rice patty here, but I would like everything that increases spice market. <laughs> if there's a way to get more money from the spice market, we need to do it. Do I rush this? We should probably take a look at what else needs to be built before I decide to rush it. That I cannot. is a very large rebellion, but it's mostly peasants. Okay. I was about to be concerned for a moment. Tong An, we should probably fortify this. Probably maybe just a little bit. This is public order. Let's get the public order building. It's fine for now because it has like zero population. <laughs> so I guess we'll do that instead. Dong O. We could upgrade this city. Some small upgrade. Industry. A fish trader. More fish trading. Income from commerce. This is industry. So probably not a good idea. So we'll just get... Wait, what? Yeah, we'll just get the food version. Uh, Jianya. Salt mine? Upgrade that finally. Seven turn upgrade. Okay. Uh, we built a garrison here in Zindu, not because it's threatened by anything, but because it has public order issues. So, is this ever going away? No, it's population. Ugh. Now over here, there's about to be a huge issue, but I can't really do anything about it for the moment. Feels really bad. Jianan, what do you want? You want upgrades. That's fine. Upgrades are good. Uh, more food production, please. We're going to need a lot of food. We are down to 44 gold. It's not a lot of gold. Five turns. One turn, which I think is two turns, actually. Okay. Just remember that those are expiring soon. Let us see what transpires. Sunsa is um, coming out against us, and that's a little annoying. Hello, Liu Bei. I'm glad to see you're still alive. What shall Cao Cao do? <laughs> He's down to one settlement. Yep, congratulations, former emperor. It's yours. And then you're gonna die. <laughs> What's happening here? A lot of movement. You want me to... No. No. I am not becoming your tributary. You're down here? Uh, okay. The central plains are becoming very crowded, people. Why aren't you fighting in the north? You know, there's two kingdoms up there. Just go squabble between them. <laughs> Leave me alone. Uh, a valiant defeat. What does this map look like? Really? So how is this a valiant defeat exactly? Because they are deploying very little forces. But again, the generals are just going to kind of carry it. Do we try? Xiang hunters, of course. Normally I would try this, but I'm not going to. They just have so much cav in the generals, so... We'll let it go. Shall let it go. But don't worry. It shall come back to us in good time. Are you finally moving against me? Nope. <laughs> You're just going down the Yangtze River. That's fine. Eventually you'll meet up with me again, and I'll just kill you. 
Liu Bei has some massive public order issues. We've lost the livestock farm in Shen and Yu Zheng. Uh, Zhang Fengping requested Qin Shu Han to join their war against the Yellow Tiger Rebellions. Sai Mao has passed away. The cunning. I was going to say something that I probably shouldn't. <laughs> the cunning lady that took over for... Actually, she's succeeded, right? Or, seceded, right? From, um... Liu Bei's faction? Succeeded by Sang Xin Ting. I actually don't remember what happened, but that's close enough. We have lost the city of Changsha. Tao Ying requested their master, Kingdom of Yan, to go to war with Har Yi. Poor Har Yi. Surrender imminent in Sang Wu, a general in need. Well, we're not letting them kill Tai Shi, sir. So we're paying that. I started to think what would happen if you didn't have the 500 gold, and they're just like, well, kill my legendary general. Sure, why not? All right. Liu Zhe, former emperor. You really fell for this, didn't you? This is a Pyrrhic victory. We could starve them out, but I don't really want to wait around that long. So I guess we're going to fight this. We can kill the former emperor ourselves. I guess Gung Ji is going to do the duel. Let us begin. I think part of the issue is the high priority threats. Time to fight! Time to win! Yes, it is. Time for all those things. Specifically Together, the winning part. We shall bring transformation to China. We've already kind of done that. You know? Samai? No thoughts? Our These glorious leader? Are strangers to us. Caution is wise. I mean, they're not that much of a stranger. It's just Sun Tzu, who somehow got the former emperor. We're attacking, so we're going to have to do some Let cheeky things. Oh, yeah, we can vent. <laughs> ah, I forget what this is called. I always forget. Guerrilla deployment, yes. It's vanguard deployment in uh, Total Warhammer. But we can do that with all of our ranged units. I don't want to make them group one. I always forget that this is not the strongest front line in the world. But it's okay. They don't need to really hold out because our cavalry is probably going to do all the heavy lifting. Well, our cavalry in our range. Our range does a lot of damage. Just an absurd amount of damage. And the best part is that they have so much ammunition thanks to Semai that it doesn't really matter. Alright. We might have Gungji go duel. This is the damaging one. Taishi Sa could also probably do it, but he's not the best duelist. So. Really? Now, of course, these are our archer cavalry. Bow cavalry, whatever you want to call them. So we are going to use them to skirmish and just upset the enemies in any way possible. The more we can irritate them, the happier I'm going to be. China will revel in your death. And shall. Your words are as pathetic as you are. 82 ammunition. Oh my goodness. Move. Oh. Move. Zhang Jin is challenging Gungji. I, I accept. Run, run. He's just going to get owns. We could also use these guys to flank around and shut down some of their archers. I don't think that's a wise idea. But it's an idea, you know? We're just going to go around this livestock farm. Mount a Saber Militia. You're about to have a bad time. A very bad time indeed. So this is our light and this is our medium. These are the guys that are going to do all the work. Well, most of it. Might as well just shut them down now. Go on! Keep up! I know you can do it! You're giving them a lot of credit. talk and battle! Look, we broke them instantly. The enemy unit, please. What the power? emperor is challenging Tai Shi Se, but I. Eh, yeah, sure, whatever. I must prevail. Double time. It is a commander. He's not the best the combatant in the world. They were no match. That's about what I expected. Ready. Let's move up here. Get ready to drop the debuff. Coming over here. Where's my other calf? being tired. Not tired, but let's get into Wedge. They're just going to charge right into their face. Look at this glorious charge. 
Boom. Oh, yes. Instantly half health. Look, the enemy run. This reduces their armor and their speed, so let's just leave that alone. Over here, we've been chased by Cav, which is a little unfortunate. All right, we're going to drop our debuff here. I think Semai can kill her. Pretty handily. Wear you out. These are our lower level cav. If only wars were won with witty Just words. Get away, please. These guys are uh, found spears. Not the ideal situation. We don't really have any high priority targets for them to kill. What are you guys up to? You need to go over here. The enemy unit flees. Daishisa is victorious. Unfortunately, I didn't catch any of that duel against the former emperor. I apologize. Please don't fight spears. It's not a good idea. The time has come. So now we'll just collapse on the strategist and kill her. It's a plan. Fire upon them. I need you guys to go this way. No, don't fire upon them. Cannibal. Maybe we just hold the cannibals because we're kind of everywhere. You guys need to run. When you put something on skirmish, you can't really control it once something gets near it, unfortunately. Uh, which is why I'm having such a hard time getting them away manually. The enemy general is fallen. Down they go. No match. Appears that it all they could stomach. So there should be an incredible morale break here in just a moment. Move on quickly. Guess you can charge into that real quick. Cavalry. What are you doing? Oh. Right. But I told you to. <laughs> see if we can get some shots Let's on try. this. Let's see, what else is not broken? Not much. That is an easy victory against the former Emperor. I don't know why he dueled Taishisa. That just wasn't smart. Taishisa, of course, does not have the best duelist setup, but he has some pretty good equipment. Like, very good equipment, I think. He's been with us forever, so... He is our Prime Minister? Has been restored. Maybe not. We can check. We captured him, but he won't let me employ him. No. All right, well... The Han has come to an end. Consider we have no need. A mercy. A fine settlement. I feel a little bad we'll killing him, but not order. much of a choice, you know? Let's upgrade that bad boy. Give me more food. We're sitting on 66 at the moment, which is a sizable amount. Meditate on peace. Prepare we for can me. reach this? I think so. It's saying one. Our cause is just a noble. Wait, is it one and then two? Oh my goodness. Towards destiny. That's fine. It's fine. Kind of. <laughs> po Yang, what are we doing in Po Yang? We're trying to reduce the insane amount of corruption. That's a good start. We do have one assignment available. Who is it? We do have the corruption going on in uh, Lu Xiong, but that needs to stay there. Or Jeanier, rather. Wait a minute. We're... Okay, he has some corruption now. I uh, can't really do anything about that, however. I don't really care. Ah, yes. Chi Guan En and Sun Luo are here. Because they... We're in an army that we disbanded. That is correct. So we can reduce corruption by 50% with Yin Gu. We might do that over here in Boyang. It is currently a whopping 56%, so let us do that. We should probably try and get that um, assignment for more people. Now, a few things that we need to get here. In fact, many things. So if we wanted to continue playing Pokemon, we could get these guys in 10 turns. Or 5 turns? We pick this up, and then we get that for the next reform. This unlocks the next level of forges, which increases our industry income. The military forge, which we want. It also gives us the military supply village, which I don't really care about. Uh, is this the final? Yeah, the final forge. Well, there are a lot of options here. Um, I think we're going to play Pokemon, though. This will give us very sturdy shielded frontline units, which we kind of need. So we shall continue to play Pokemon. Taishi, sir, has leveled up. And finally gets zeal. That is what we want. Yes? Yes. Own army. 
Yes, please. Thank you very much. Uh, checking our court real quick, because... Yes, Tai Shi Sir is our Prime Minister. An excellent Prime Minister he is. Our faction heir is Kong Lu, our eldest son. And we have a spot open for Administrator. What do we want here? Oh my, Yuan Shu. Public order, building upkeep, income from all sources. You do a lot of things. I kind of like that. And isn't he incredibly... Yeah, he's a power monger. He's also age 70. So he wants a higher core position. This would solve some of that. Sure, why not? He can go to Po Yang if someone isn't already there. So we want to increase money. If possible. So Zin... Or, yeah, Po Yang. Here we go. Boom. Easy. It was almost like I knew what I was talking about for a moment. So we've claimed this. We are a bit afraid of Sun Tzu coming from here. Ah, Shihui has come to take back his spice markets. We don't like that. So we'll head back in this direction, I think, for now. Mm. Yeah, I guess. We'll head over here, reclaim the Yulin, and then head this way. Hopefully it takes them a little bit of time to rebuild another army. This is terrifying. We're about to lose Sangwu. Can't do much about it, though. Over here, Balian. Bring news of what occurred in my I think we're just taking the straight port. That's the sturdy trade port, though. So we'll go here, and we'll take it next turn. We are afraid of all this. All of it. <laughs> but can't do much about it at the moment. For Sima Fu, we can reach Jiangxia. Do we? I think we do. Yeah. Because uh, we have Yuan Shu to come down here. Or to deal with that mess. So we go in this direction. And take this. Gimme. It is a very weak city. And I think that's... A quick wit dodges the hardest Sai Chin Ting right there. We couldn't Let reach her. Use of it. Yeah, it is. Or er, Sang Chin Ting, sorry. My Lord. Excuse me. Uh, I guess we'll just upgrade the city. I... Ooh, give her this. Give her this now. <laughs> Goodbye. Uh, we... Do we have... No, we just have military access. Okay. Because we can turn around and kill Harry whenever we feel like it. I Hopefully, answer, my lord. they kind of kill him, like Machao and etc. But they might not. Who knows? That she just gained a rank. Before the filial. Blah, 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 blah. Gong Yi. No one that I recognize. They're all strategists, though. That's weird. We could do spy stuff, but I'm not a fan of spy stuff, you know? It's kind of Sao Sao's thing, and he's kind of rude. The courts. This would reduce corruption. We have a lot of it. Well, not a lot of it. Some of it. I guess we can take it. We haven't upgraded anything in Donghai in a long time. Probably for good reason, huh? I'm actually looking at the Yizhou Islands right now. Probably upgrade this. Maybe. What do we want to do down here? That's a good question. It's a fishing port that makes us food. Food is great. We could also make it give us commerce income, which is not bad. Not bad at all. So I guess we'll build that, which will increase our food production down there. Pang Chung. Uh, we're about to lose this, so not a huge fan of upgrading it. Lu Xiong. Ah, uh, Lu Xiong has held. Lu Xiong has seen some things. Now, I don't know why we have this. Was it just for money? It might have just been for money. Ideally, we would be trying to buff this income in some capacity. But as peasant and commerce, split income is kind of hard to just buff. We're about to lose Shen too. So many terrible things are about to happen. Feels bad. I think that's it. That's all we can do this turn. We take a look at our deals real quick. I'm pretty sure one was expiring. Ah, oh, expires next turn. Okay. 900 gold we're going to lose next turn. That's fine. I think we'll call it here. So thank you all for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. And I look forward to the continuation of the long Kong Rong Kong spearheaded by the silver eminent Sima Yi. 
next time. Bye-bye.